Hi, everybody. Chris Rose here in studio and out in Mossel Bay. Chris Fallows is standing by with another tow. OK, so some good news. The crew have just spotted Zola hunting a seal near the island. So we know she's in the area, and maybe, just maybe, she'll have a look at our decoy. Conditions are absolutely perfect out here. Visibility is fairly low. Conditions are beautiful and calm with a light offshore breeze. And this is the perfect area for us to tow the decoy. Certainly the place that I'd expect to see her. This is her turf, this is her territory, and today's the day. If I was a shark, I couldn't pick a better day to have a go at a decoy. Come on, shark. Breach. And that is Zola. Yes, it is. 12 feet, biggest shark in the area right now. Just a graceful, efficient attack on the decoy. And looking at shark vision, she is way over 10 feet. So great to see Zola. I really think because of her size, speed, and experience as a hunter, that she's going to be the shark to beat. Just a beautiful animal. Beautiful backdrop. Let's go ahead and break down that breach. Zola reached 27 miles per hour. The tip of her upper caudal keel, that's her tail section, folks, hit 11 feet and for hang time, a whopping 1.5 seconds, best we've seen so far. Zola is certainly a favorite to win this competition, but first, she'll have to get by the other big shark in the bay. Allison Towner has more on the great white they call Nandy. Nandi means sweet in the Zulu tongue, but to the residents of Seal Island, she is anything but. Awesome conditions today for a tow. I'm feeling good about this. Towing at a brilliant speed for a breach. Come on, shark. Wow! My word! Now that was a breach. This is Nandi. Wow, this is the second breach of the competition and she got a tremendous amount of air. This is what we call a Polaris breach. It's literally like a missile launching from a submarine. She shows so much control and athleticism. That must be close to a world record. That's an incredible breach. That is just crazy. Okay, anxious to break this breach down. The speed of this shark, 29 miles per hour. Her height, 15 feet, tying an all-time record, and hang time is 1.582 seconds. What a breach by Nandy. Air Jaws has been a staple of Shark Week for over 20 years now, and we've seen some eye-popping breaches over the years. One notorious leap happened when a gigantic shark went airborne over our own Dickie Chevelle. Whoa! Unbelievable! Dickie, that must be the highlight of your life so far. Well, I've had a few highlights, Chris, but Hornet is still number one. <laughs> I was filming in the Hornet for this one, and a massive shark came flying out of the water and just hung there. It felt like forever. So the shark who gets the most hang time this week will get the Hornet medal.
That's right. And the shark with the highest breach this week will receive the Colossus Medal. In honor of this unbelievable breach from one of our favorites, Colossus. Back in 2012, when he went over the top of our producer, Jeff Kerr. Unbelievable! Finally, the fastest shark will receive the Phantom Medal, named after the slow motion cameras that were first used in 2010 and they absolutely revolutionized the way we see these animals flying out of the water. It's still Thando holding onto the lead on the speed chart at 30 miles per hour. Hang time, it's Nandy at 1.582 seconds. And the big one, the high flyer so far, is Nandy with a record tying 15 foot breach. So it all comes down to this. Can Nandy hang on and win the competition with her all-time record-tying 15-foot breach? Or will the top challenger, Zola, make one last run at the medal? All the top spots on the leaderboard are still up for grabs. Chris Fallows, what are you thinking? Well, the only thing you can reliably predict about sharks is they are often unpredictable and will surprise you with their incredible capabilities. Zola certainly is on everybody's mind out here. The decoy is now in the water and we're approaching the hot zone. So let's see what happens. Come on, Zola, let's do this. attack probably originated in deep water and then when she saw the decoy no hesitation just magnificent and shark vision has this breach at at least 15 feet but let's go back to the studio for official numbers that was amazing with an epic final breach it is looking great for zola let's go now to the final scoreboard and the medal ceremony that last breach from Zola at 31 miles per hour, about 45 feet per second, takes the phantom medal for the fastest shark at Mossel Bay 2021. And Zola with that final breach also takes the Hornet medal for the most hang time with a gravity defying 2.0 seconds. Will Zola take the top spot for height as well? Here are the final results. With a breach measured at 15 feet, six inches, it is Zola and a new world record for flying sharks. With one last amazing breach and no time remaining on the clock, Zola, the 12 foot female great white comes through the clutch and sweeps all three medals. <laughs>